Hey, what's up? I'm Janae Eichel, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do my daytime, everyday makeup look. My first step, work on my eyebrows. And sometimes, it, it'll take me literally like 30 minutes just on my eyebrows. Just because I feel like it's, for me, the most important part. The biggest challenges for me is like making sure that they're even. We've all heard that eyebrows are cousins. Or is, what is it? Sisters, not twins. Sorry. I think that's good. And next, I do my eyeshadow. I believe this is like the OG Naked palette. I really love the names of these and I'm like one of the peop those people that like picks like a nail polish because of the name. One of these is called Hustle. And when I'm doing shows, I, you know, I'm hustling. Like I'm like working. So I kind of like mix Hustle and Toast it together. I'm gonna start with Buck. I just sweep it across the eyelid to like the outer corner and just build it up just a little. It just adds like a little depth to my eyes. Dab each one just a little bit. Then I put it under so it creates kind of like an ombre from the bottom to the top. And the reason why I do the eyes first is because with the concealer, I can clean up anything that has, you know, fallen and I can sort of like shape it. I'll show you what I'm talking about. So I use Pro Conceal and it's actually really inexpensive. So I have this little palette. You can sort of like mix it up and thin it out before you put it on yourself. It just makes for like a smoother application. Then I take a concealer brush and sort of just... And when you put less on your little palette, then you use less. And then I sort of go in on my nose just on the sides to create that shape that I want. I don't like to cover like my freckles and stuff like that. So I just do it as light as possible. I go in with my beauty blender and I also wet it just a little. Whoops. <laughs> just wanted to have a little moisture to keep my under eye from drying out. And then I sort of just Blend it. I'm starting to look prettier, so that means this is going good. <laughs> now I'm gonna do my foundation. I use NARS Sheer Glow in Syracuse. Make sure you have your pump so you don't waste any products. I go back to my little palette and just do a few pumps, just like a little bit. So what I like about this foundation is that it's pretty sheer, but you can also build it up if you want more coverage. I like to put it on super thin so that my skin can like still shine through. Then I just take the foundation and sort of clean up the top of the eyebrow. Nami gets into my makeup. She'll be 10 this year. A few Halloweens ago, she was Cleopatra and I did her makeup and I let her keep the makeup. So every now and then she'll walk out with like a bunch of bronzer on. And I'm always just telling her like, you don't need that. Contour. I like to just follow my natural curves of my face. For my nose, I literally buy this palette just to use this color. I kind of like blend the two. I like to create like a little button nose. Do a little circle at the point, at the, I don't know, whatever that's called. This took me a while to get right. It would look right in like photo shoots and stuff, but in person it would just look like, girl, <laughs> what are you doing? All right, the contour is done. This is what adds that like glow. Then I use my finger. Here's a trick. And I go right here on like the ball of my nose to give it like a cute little boop. And a little bit in this middle. So it just creates like more definition, I guess. You see? Okay, it's 
coming together. Then I use the same highlighter and I also use it under the eyebrow. I'm gonna set this so that I don't get oily and greasy with Laura Mercier translucent powder. So this is my favorite brush. So I kind of just pat it lightly. When I'm wearing makeup like days in a row, my skin gets super congested and just doesn't like it. When I'm around like the people that know me the best, I don't wear any makeup. Even like my boyfriend, I'm just like, you know how I look at this point. Like <laughs> So, where is it? I'm pretty messy down here. <laughs> I'm gonna take the same pencil that I did my eyebrows with and I'm gonna use it sort of as an eyeliner. Sort of extend it. The reason why I like using this is because it's super precise. And just create some drama. Then I go to the outer corner and just smoke it out a little bit. This is not as defined as the inner corner. Oh, these angles are cray cray. Little shimmer. Gonna blend it out just a little bit. Then I'm gonna add just a little to the inner corner, just right here. The mascara. This is called Ico. <laughs> And I had never heard of it, but I was like, oh, it's perfect because it sounds like my middle name. Which a lot of people don't know, my middle name is Aiko, it's not my last name. I am not very picky when it comes to mascara, so I would use any mascara. I just like to use it on the, you know, the tip. I don't, I don't like comb through my eyelash with it. My bottom lashes are super long. I don't really like to wear lipstick all the time. I find that it dries my lips out, so I like to use lip gloss and just let my natural like pink lip show. This is my favorite. My favorite lip gloss is called Lip Maximizer by Dior. Uh, it has collagen in it, so it gives a nice plumpness and it does that thing where it like makes your lips feel like all tingly. And then, I'm, I lied, there's one last little, little, little step. I take the highlighter that I use on my cheeks and my inner eye and all that, and I use my finger, and I just put it right in the little dip of my lip. It's just like, cute. <laughs> I'm done. So, I've told you all my secrets, but now I've gotta go, bye.